Thank you for watching my channel. Please subscribe and like. Now back to the news. Rescue crews plumbing the depths of the Atlantic for the Titan submersible that was lost Sunday with five people aboard. We'll get assistance from the Victor 6000 robot, a highly advanced deep sea craft, and one of the few vessels on Earth capable of reaching the wreck. The Victor 6000 is being rushed to the search site aboard French research vessel L'Atalante, but is not expected to arrive until Wednesday evening Eastern Time, around 12 hours before the oxygen supply on the missing submersible is expected to run out Thursday. A 10-foot-long, remote-controlled robot with a bright yellow back, the Victor 6000, has been described as a flagship device for underwater operations by the French network BMTV and is capable of reaching a depth of 6,000 meters, 20,000 feet. With the Titanic lying 12,500 feet beneath the waves on the ocean floor, the craft should be more than capable of reaching it. A rescue would see the Victor 6000 accompanied by Horizon Arctic, a powerful tug and supply ship which has a large cable which the deep sea craft can take down with it, toward the wreck of the Titanic. Victor 6000 is equipped with a robotic arm, which could be used for dislodging the lost Titan submersible, if it is discovered trapped within the Titanic wreckage. It can also attach the cable from the Horizon Arctic to the vessel to help pull it to safety. Victor is not capable of lifting the submarine up on its own, Olivier Leffert from the French state-run Oceanic Research Institute of Remer told Reuters. Victor is able to do visual exploration with all the video equipment it has. It is also equipped with manipulating arms which could be used to extricate the sub, such as by sectioning cables or things that would be blocking it at the bottom, he said. But with no time to spare, in order for the robot to pull off a rescue, crews already on the site would likely need to locate the missing submersible before the Victor 6000 arrives. Leffert said the US Navy reached out to Ifrima requesting help, and that the organization were one of the five missing crew members, Paul Henry Nargiolet, 77, previously worked, could not say no. This is the logic of seafarers. Our attitude was. We are close, we have to go, he said. Victor 6000 is operated by a 25-person crew on board its mothership, the Atalante, all of whom are speeding to the search site, with the hope of pulling off a miracle. We can work non-stop for up to 72 hours, we don't need to stop at night, Leffer told Reuters. Aircraft from the US and Canadian Coast Guards, recently picked up on repetitive knocking noises emanating from the deep in the vicinity, where surface crews lost contact with the Titan on Sunday. It is believed the sounds could be coming from the stranded passengers hammering on the hull of their submersible to signal the surface.